And this one of those stories is hard to understand. Someone painted a turtle pink. And now investigators trying to figure out who did it and why. Fox 35's Ray Vieta is live in studio with why this is considered a case of animal abuse. Ray. John, you know what's even more troubling? This. That pink turtle was not the only one. This is a gopher tortoise. It was found with a pink shell in St. Lucie County, but you could see there are others where this has happened to. It's not the first time someone has done this in Florida. And wildlife experts say painting turtles is no joke. It's actually a deadly prank. A desperate plea from FWC. Send in your tips on the prankster who doused this gopher tortoise in pink. Experts say the paint causes breathing problems. It seeps through their shells and lets toxic chemicals into their bloodstreams. It also makes them more visible to predators. The pink turtle was found in St. Lucie County. Another painted turtle was spotted in Okeechobee County, but hasn't been captured. Back in 2018, this red turtle popped up in Lake County. Wildlife officers arrested this man. Turns out he allegedly dumped the paint into a hole behind his shop, right where the turtle was burrowing. Whether it's intentional or not, I think this is a good learning experience for the public to know that paint or any substances like that are dangerous to these animals. Then about five years ago, two other painted gopher tortoises were spotted in South Florida, a blue one and a red one. Plain and simple, FWC says, go find another canvas. If you want to paint something, go get a rock, and you can have a pet rock. I think that right there is the best advice. Go paint a rock. Suspects in this case could be charged with a felony animal harassment charge. Now, if you see a painted turtle, FWC says don't capture it or try to clean it yourself. You can text for help at tip at mywfwc.com. John, back to you.